Good evening, everyone, and welcome to The Forecast, the pre-game show here on Manchester Storm TV. I'm your match night host, Aidan Millen, and I'm joined by Storm TV commentator, Max Artis. Tonight, the Manchester Storm look to get back to winning ways against the Five Flyers. Max, how are the Storm going to do it? It's going to have to be a team effort. It's going to have to be all guys working together as one, a full unit working together to get the job done. Both teams looking to get themselves back into the wing column, whether that be in the Challenge Cup or, um, or league games. Both teams, I think, four, maybe five losses on the trot. So it's going to be a tough one tonight and see which team can kind of tough it out. Obviously, it was a very tough night for the Storm on Thursday here against the Sheffield Steelers. Um, the Storm started really well. Had a really bright first period, took the first goal. Looked like we are going into the break with a lead. Conceded a goal with just a second left in the period, but then the boys didn't recover. Sheffield took over and resulted in a 5-1 loss. How, as a player, just two days ago, coming from a result like that, how do you recover? What do you go into this game thinking? I think as soon as that game was done, a lot of it was taken out of the guys' minds. Like that, that game's done and dusted. It's in the Challenge Cup. This is league. It's different competition and a different, different opponent. A quick turnaround with uh, one day's practice and straight back into this game. So dust it off. You're a professional and you know your jobs, you know your roles and the whole team's got to, got to play to their strengths. And one of the things that we spoke about on Thursday, of course, is the fact that Storm haven't been scoring freely. We've noticed that the Five Flyers have a similar problem. Are we thinking tonight it's going to be the day that all changes and we're going to be in for a 6-5? Like, how do you see tonight going? It could be really cagey or the, the goals could come from absolutely anywhere. It's, um, it's going to be an absolute uh, craze if, uh, if, if, the, if the Storm get going. Anybody in that lineup can do a job and can put the buck in the net. It's just who's going to step up to the mark and who's going to, uh, who's going to lead this team forward. And going into the players to watch tonight, for the Manchester Storm, we need a spark on offence. And for me, the player who impresses me is Samuel Tremblay. Puts a lot of work in, a lot of energy. He's got, had a really good pedigree last season in the ECHL. Like he had a slow, a slow start there as well, but second half of the year, he really started getting in the points, hit some form. And I know at some point this season that is going to hit and hopefully that tonight will be the night for him. Uh, for me on Storm, it's going to be uh, Lauren Yolet. His physical play at the start of the season really did kind of give the guys on the rest of the lineup some energy to go forward with and kind of some positivity up and down the lineup. Let's see if he can kind of be that spark of inspiration for the rest of the Storm lineup. And over to the Five Flyers players to watch for me. Shane Owen, you know, he's been with the Five Flyers several seasons now. He did a stint, I believe, in Belfast for a season. Well, he's been around the league a long time. Consistently good net mind who does it night after night, season after season. You know, if he performs well, Five have got a really good platform to build from. For me, Hal Chuck, he's got the pedigree. His dad played and is that legendary name. Uh, see if he can live up to his, uh, his dad's skates and uh, his dad, fill his dad's boots uh, with, some, with some good scoring and some good points. He could be danger for the Storm. And so far, we've done two forecasts. We've had some very good predictions. We had Max successfully predict the score for our first time round. And then Thursday night, Max predicts Michael Coral, the man to, man to watch for the Storm. He scores first. I predict Robert Dowd. He scores first. So now we're on a good run. What do you think tonight? Uh, I wouldn't want to put a score prediction out there, but if you're going to force me to, which I think you're going to, um, I think it's going to be a 3-2 final. I'm hoping it goes the way of the Storm, but with how tight these two teams are, it could go the way of the Flyers. So I'm edging my bets a little bit, but of course I'm always back in the Storm. I think on behalf of myself and everybody in the building, we will take that tonight. But we do hope that you all enjoy the match tonight and have a great night.